<laughs> this is Live Drunk Outside. This is our Shell Met camera. We have cloudy skies out there this morning. Time right now is 620. We have generally dry conditions. North Shore starting to see some spotty sprinkles. Temperatures moving from the low to mid 70s into the mid 70s this afternoon. Breezy conditions, rain and storm chances picking up. Today we do have a risk for some strong and possibly severe storms. That best chance from the lunchtime hour on into the early evening hours, and then we'll start to see those rain chances going down. But right now, picking up the rainfall for areas out to the west, starting to move into new roads in Baton Rouge. Moderate to heavy rain indications of that with those reds and yellows picking up here on the satellite and radar pushing towards Baton Rouge. That will continue to press on to the east. Just some light showers for us here on the North Shore. Now north of Ponchatoula, right around northeastern parts of Hammond this morning, pushing to the northeast. So areas like Bogalusa, St. Tammany Parish into Cummington will see some light showers. That includes parts of the Mississippi coast as well. Here's the big system helping to spawn those showers and storms. Upper level low giving us some lift this morning. All that moisture pulling in off the Gulf of Mexico and stretching down from the Pacific. That's pulling in, so no shortage of moisture. We have that marginal risk today of strong and severe storms. Gusty winds, possibly some hail and lightning. Maybe an isolated tornado. Already one warning that was in St. Landry Parish earlier this morning and some moderate to heavy rain possible at times. Seeing that this morning, Friday night into early Saturday, the second round of possibly severe storms, and that's a slight risk, so a small little notch up from what we have today. Here's a forecast model on timing, some light showers. This takes us through 930, so morning commutes could see some wet roadways out there, but I don't expect the stronger storms to start to push in until la afternoon today, so lunchtime and onward. North Shore, South Shore getting in on that moderate to heavy rain and gusty winds. Have that WDSU app ready to go. Make sure your cell phone is charged for those warnings and updates. By 430, that heavy rain continues to push east, and by 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock, we should be dry. Fog starts to build in again late tonight into Friday. Friday afternoon, I think, will be generally dry, but Friday night into early Saturday morning, another strong line of storms, potentially some isolated tornadoes. We don't like this timing, of course, because it's overnight, but that potential certainly exists into the pre-dawn hours of Saturday, so have those severe weather plans ready to go. Where will you stay? Where will you be when that potential hits? Rainfall totals two to three inches possible today, and then we'll add on to that the potential for an additional one to two inches. We do have fog out there, some of that dense in spots, so a dense fog advisory until nine o'clock. Your temperatures in the 70s out the door. More highs in the 70s through Saturday. A cold front rolls through. We have 60s on Sunday and the start off next week. Then we warm back up into the low 70s by Wednesday. That's your